Hi, I'm Vered Hollander Goldfarb. I teach at the Conservative Yeshiva in Jerusalem, which has given me the opportunity to meet some Shomre Torah people all, <coughs> along the way. Ron Goldberg, Scott Wessel, David, and I invite you to come join us and learn at the Yeshiva. Rabbi Hanina Ben Dosa in Pirkei Avot tells us that anyone whose fear of sin precedes his wisdom, his wisdom is enduring. But anyone whose wisdom precedes his fear of sin, his wisdom is not enduring. We come from a long tradition that values learning. Tremendous value just for the sake of learning. Lishma, for the sake of learning. Nonetheless, Rabbi Hanina tells us all that learning could be worthless if we don't have boundaries. If we don't have moral guidelines that inform our learning. In other words, we can learn anything. People have. Right? People have convinced themselves that the most awful ideas in the world are legitimate. We need guidelines. We need boundaries. We need to have fear of sin before we proceed in our learning. But he also tells us that after we learn, anyone whose deeds exceed his wisdom, his wisdom is enduring. But anyone whose wisdom exceeds his deeds, his wisdom is not enduring. What are we doing with all that learning? Is it purely an intellectual pursuit? It has not affected us. It has not informed who we are and how we behave in this world and what we're doing for this world. That wisdom is not enduring. We're not leaving anything behind. If we want to leave something behind, all that learning and all that wisdom has to do something for this world. So anyone who takes all that wonderful learning and lets it affect him or her, and let it inform how they live their life and the deeds that they leave behind. Because in the end of the day, it's our actions that speak. That person, his or her wisdom is enduring. <laughs>